Kilauea is no longer erupting. The volcano has been quiet ever since the lava supply to the summit crater ceased on June 19. On June 30, scientists lowered the USGS volcano alert level to advisory and the aviation color code to yellow. The Hawaiian Volcano Observatory reported sulfur dioxide emissions have decreased to near pre-eruption background levels, and seismic activity, including eruptive tremor, has been low ever since the eruption paused. Just a day or two after the summit eruption paused, the observatory uploaded some new video showing the volcanic activity just prior to things going quiet. The video included these close-up views of the spatter cone that was built by the eruptive vent on the caldera wall, which was the focus of the eruptive activity towards the end. From this angle, a lava stream can be seen exiting from the base of the cone. These clear views of the vent were captured on June 16th. Another upload shows footage gathered during a helicopter flight on the same day. Again, eruptive activity is focused at the vent on the southwest wall of the crater. This video was captured on June 18th. The fountain appeared even more dramatic in its final day with lava pouring into a channel at the base of the spatter cone and spreading onto the crater floor. At one point, geologists estimated that the lava fountain was reaching a height of at least 10 meters or 33 feet. The eruption paused abruptly around 4 p.m. on Monday, June 19th. Although Kilauea is presently quiet, geologists say there remains the potential for eruptive activity to resume in the near future at or near the summit of the volcano, with little or no warning. In Hilo, miles away from the Kilauea summit, site preparations are underway for a new facility that will monitor volcanoes and support conservation science. On June 28th, state and federal officials, including the U.S. Secretary of the Interior, attended a traditional ground blessing ceremony for the planned U.S. Geological Survey facility that will be a future home to the Hawaiian Volcano Observatory and the Pacific Island Ecosystems Research Center. The previous Volcano Observatory facility, located at the edge of the Kilauea summit crater, was irreparably damaged during the 2018 eruption. The new facility will be located on the University of Hawaii at Hilo campus. It is estimated that construction will be completed in late 2025. I'm just grateful for all of our federal partners. We are kind of creating a whole little research park up here. And so to have the Department of Agriculture, Forestry, and USGS is going to make a really powerful collaboration with our STEM programs here at UH Hilo. I think having the opportunity to co-locate um, with the university um, is just going to make it that much easier for our scientists to interact and engage with their colleagues at the university, and in particular to be able to tap into the extraordinary students that you have here.